Bioshock Remastered Survivor Difficulty No Vita Chamber. You are now in the army of Slack. Saddle up, lock and load. Let's do this thing. We're about to face off with Beach Wilkins, a boss Nitro Splicer, and he has asked us to surrender all our weapons before we can go inside. Do it, no problem. Here we go. Put them in the pneumo tube, and this is it. You know, all we got is our Charles Dickens and our wrench and our plasmids. Um, let's swap out for the right plasmids. We don't need hypnotized Big Daddy. Let's swap out for incinerate. Yeah, that's going to be very useful. Lots of ice to melt in this area. Starting right here. Get this. Very good. Don't need this right away. Shorten alarms. Um, grab that. I say grab that. Very good. And we're good. There is a hacking tool here, an automatic hacking tool. And Peach Wilkins, we're just gonna like. He's a nitro splicer, so we're gonna give him a taste of his own medicine and throw a whole bunch of explosive containers at him. There's three to be had in this area. There's actually five, but three immediately available one, two, and one right beside the Circus of Values machine. There you go, let me just double back here and get that Eve hypo. Alright, here's the plan boys and girls. There is a camera over there. We're gonna go running over, hack the camera, come back here, wait for Peach Wilkins to spawn, put out a target dummy and throw this blow up shit at him. And hopefully he dies. As soon as he dies, we get our weapons back. Alright, that's the plan. Let's do it. Camera hacked. Great. So it's gonna call down this climbing way back. Okay, here's where we started. Okay, as soon as he finishes talking, count two steamboats and lay down the target dummy. That's it. One steamboat, two steamboat, target dummy goes down, switch over to telekinesis. Come on, Peach. He was ours. Ours. Peach, there he is. Got him. Yeah. Okay, that's it. As soon as that door op opens, you realize... Um, Busy. I'm busy. I can't talk. Shut up, Atlas. And we got all our weapons back. First thing you want to do is hit up this power to the people machine. I'll explain later. I'm too busy right now. I want to upgrade the shotgun. Give the shotgun got more damage. There we go. Yeah, doing live commentary while doing this. Some of this uh, high difficulty level gaming is extremely difficult. It's like an extra added level of difficulty. Okay, so everything's down to Delroy here. There's a turret, a machine, machine gun turret around the corner there. Um, it's kind of finicky, but you can get a target dummy right up here. Like that. Just jump up here, jump up here, go over and hack it. This will watch our back as we're exploring the freezer area. Yeah, power to the people machines can be used to upgrade your weapons. There's 12 of them throughout the game. And you can pause the video when I hit it to see all the upgrades that are available. There you go. What are you shooting at? Oh, the target down me. Okay, calm down. Calm down. It's okay. Alright, now. Let's explore the freezer area. Lots of stuff to get. Systematically switch over to the shotgun. 
I believe we have extra electric buckets. I hate that one. It's like low visibility. You can't see what you're shooting at. I think there's another guy in there too. Okay, more explosive containers here. Some meltdown in that area to let us get in the hole there. There, that looks like an auto hack. I just melt down everything. Because the number of times I play through this game, I still have to remember for it. Like each. Where pickups are on all the ice piles. Um, Peach Wilkins should be good for. Where the hell did he go down? Is that him right there? Yeah. Nope. He, he should be good for some good loot. I thought he melted that. Yeah, I think that's him right there. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Continuing now. Okay, it sounds like there's activity in here. One thing I do believe that on um, survivor mode is that enemies move a lot faster. In my humble opinion, I think that's another thing that changed. That changes from survivor from hard to survivor. And another thing I know for sure is that big daddies don't stay shocked nearly as long as they do on hard mode. Because on hard, you can stun lock big daddies with electric buck. With electric buck loaded in your shotgun, you can stun lock and go up, bam, bam, and they stay stunned. They stay shocked until you have time to, to reload your shotgun. Can't do that on survivor. Can't do that. So that's another, that they just took away a whole easy method of taking down big daddies. Just stun locking them with the uh, electric buck. Okay, th this is the one to melt down. That's where all the cuties are. Eve Hypo there. Gotta remember that. And some cigarettes there. So spirit Eve Hypo. Two Eve Hypos here. Okay, freezer west side. Let me just make a note of this. Very good. We've worked the upper floor. Let's go down to the lower floor. Okay, we can see people or hear people pitching around in here. Pretty sure this is Nitro Splicer in here. Nope. Lighthead Splicer. Okay, let's get it on. Actually, we haven't finished research on you guys yet. That was a nice action shot there. Beautiful. Give me another one. I'm a little too close for comfort here, but... Okay, so working on level 3 Nitro Splicer research. I hate doing research. Just gets in the way of combat. <laughs> but the bonuses do help. I think that's it. We can, all we can manage out of this guy. Oh, hang on! That's another thing that is absolutely formidable 
on survivor mode. It's just like there's so little Eve. So you're constantly reloading your Eve hypo. Like reloading Eve hypo and that really slows you down in the middle of combat. It's like hang on, I gotta shoot up again. We're gonna fix that shortly though. Okay, you regarding a safe, a very important safe, y'all listen to this while I hack this safe. Very good. Next. I think there's some cigarettes in here. Occasionally these smugglers crates have something in them, so you should check them all. Yeah, I forget where the cigarettes are. Okay, we got two E pipes. Where's Slack? Upstairs in the freezer on the west side. And a boy. And uh This is the way out. Friendly chap. Oh. Oh, sorry. <laughs> and I don't believe there's anything there. This is probably a waste. That's it. So that's the way out. Can't resist. Right there. Okay. Two things. Let's go back and get those Eve hypos. Number one. Number two. Let's go back into the wharf area. And uh, I want to collect a proximity mine that I forgot to get. And I want to finish up some research on big daddies. There's bound to be some big daddies roaming around up there. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Ah, see? Got some potato chips from that crate. First day kit, uh, yeah, might as well. We feel her eve a little bit. Yeah, right. Forgot about that. This guy hiding underneath here. Okay, good. I got another Eve hypo, but out of that. Lots of first aid kits. There's Buzz. How you doing, Buzz? Stash these all here. I think I've got a bazillion here. I think there's another one over here. You, come here. Oh, you don't want to move, eh? Okay. And let's swap back out for Hypnotize Big Daddy, because we are going to be doing some hypnotizing. Put that guy there, very good. Yeah, we're definitely going to need him. Okay, four, five first aid kits, so we're swimming at first aid. First thing, upstairs. There's a target dummy happening here. What do we got over here? More first aid, okay. A 
here, Big Daddy. Here we go. Hey there, you coming with me? Okay, watch my back. Get this guy. Get him. Big, this dude. What? Oh, did I kill him? <laughs> okay. Good. Good looking at. It. Let's go. There's some secrets over here. More pursuit. Okay. Okay. Watch my back, Big Daddy. I got a security uh security bot too. <laughs> okay. It's the army of slack. Let's go, boys. Over the hill. Now I want to bring this guy back down because when you go up here and come back down, this ridiculously tough spider splicer comes on the scene. Um, let's see how much money we have. Uh, no, it's, I'm, I'm close to maxing out my wallet at 500 bucks. Otherwise, I would square these two big daddies off against one another and get the money out of them. But there's no point. Yeah, no, I'm just 10 bucks short of maxing out my wallet. So forget it. Sorry, right, no rumble in the jungle for these two big daddies. Yeah, this guy's way in. I just want to get around the corner and get this proxy mine that I forgot. That guy right there, and even more first aid kits. My first, did my big daddy run out already? Okay, you hang out there. I just want to uh, photograph this nitrous placer here. This one. Troublesome little bitch. You're lucky I can't bring Big Daddy in here. Oh, he's throwing shit at me. That's it. Ah. Ouch. Do that again. Jeez! Where's my electric buck? Okay, good. Okay, I don't want to hang around here too much because I don't want my big daddy taken off. I desperately need him for that spider splicer. Even more crazy things here. So let's get that like that. So is that cream coat's cake there you saw? Yes it is. Wait, what? Here. <laughs> Got to have me cream filled cake. Okay. Shit. Where's my big daddy? He lumbered off. Here he is. Okay, you. Got a job for you. Ouch! First of all, get, yeah, kill that guy. That was our turret, but whatever. <laughs> Shoot now, ask questions later. Atta boy. Okay, we're going down to take care of this ridiculously tough spider's place. I don't know what the, the developers, uh, it's like this little practical joke they play on you. This guy is like, you know, big daddy to. He's got a ridiculous number of hit points trying to take him down. So do some research on him. Whenever you go upstairs and then come back down, this thing spawns right in front or in the gatherer's garden area. Hey! Oh my gosh! Calm down. Okay. Can we squeeze by him? Squeeze by. Squeeze by. Come on, squeeze by. There we go. Okay. Okay, right in this area here. Okay, we got Team Slack happening here. There it is. Get it. Okay, let's do some research. You on a big daddy? Very good. And extra nutrition three. Sweet. <laughs> I'll just throw that in the gene bag. You on a big daddy? Okay, 
Keep going. Keep your left up. You're doing great. Okay, I think that's it. That's it. It's giving this big daddy a run for his money. Oh shit! She's going for the. I forgot about this. Did you know that uh, enemies can use little sister vents to respawn their health, just like health stations? This is something I realized uh, when I first started playing in survivor mode. Now get the fuck! Yeah, she just did that. Didn't you, little bitch? <laughs> Getting going, eh? Ow. Ow. Damn, you definitely get a spanking. Shit. Can I tell you? At least she gives it up. Holy shit, does she give it up, eh? Wow, putting out. Okay, sorry about that spanking. <laughs> wow. Excellent! <laughs> you know, that's very ace lag. Well, <laughs> okay, and there's another Eve Hypo here. You know what we're gonna do? Let's just uh, reload some Eve and grab this. And be full up on Eve. Ouch! Fuck! What the hell? Oh, I think I just ran over one of the proxy mines there. Okay. Thanks a lot, Big Daddy. Um, I think that's about it. I think we're ready to leave this level, except for this uh, plasma that they leave for you when you come back here. Wrench Lurker. Yeah, definitely want that. Yeah, when you do like a sneak attack on someone with a wrench, it does a lot more damage. Um, tempted to hook this up right now. Because the armored shell one isn't really doing me that much good. Yeah, let's hook this up right now just for the hell of it. Okay, there we go. And we're done here. No, oh my gosh! Damn. <laughs> Relentless, eh? Okay, I think this is some electric buck here. No, oh, did I use up the electric buck or what? Um, there is some more. Where is there more? In a safe somewhere, I forget. I think in the fighting McDonald's. Anyways, I don't feel like backtracking. Is it far? Okay, we'll do a quick save. And I'll do this off camera. I'll be right back. If I find something, I'll let you know. Okay, on the way back I ran into this Nitro Splicer as you saw, and I managed to max out Nitro Splicer research, which is great because these guys are a fucking pain in the ass to research. They're the worst. So uh, as soon as I come out of here, I'm going to take some health and then take this guy down. Where'd he go? Uh, did you trigger the alarm? <laughs> That's enough out of you. Damn. Good. 
Okay, sorry for the jump cut editing, uh, but I didn't want to drag you all over Raptures looking for one electric bug, so it was what I managed to pick up, so that's it. And we're ready to exit the level. Right here, back in the freezer bottom floor of Peach Wilkins' establishment, and you go out this door and into Smuggler's Hideout. That's it for this level. You got us! Should be smooth sailing from here. I'll meet you up ahead. See you up ahead. That's it for Neptune's Bounty. And we finally get to hook up with Atlas. That's coming up next video. I'd like to thank you all very much for watching. And if you thought this was remotely entertaining and or informative, please subscribe to my channel to get more videos like this. Hot. Off the press. Alright. See you next video.